Hi everyone, in this video we'll take you on a food tour for three specialty restaurants from the Grand Palladium Costa Mujeres Resort for dinner. La Adelita, which serves Mexican food, Portofino, the Italian eatery, and El Dorado, the steakhouse. If you are staying at the sister resort of TRS Coro, you can also eat at these restaurants. Uh, reservations are required, so be sure to book during check-in for the hotel. Food and drinks are all complimentary as the resort isn't all-inclusive. First, let's take a look at La Adelita, the Mexican specialty restaurant. Thank you. This is the sauce of the house. This is pico de gallo. Mm -hmm. Coriander, tomato, onion. No spicy. This green sauce is avocado and tomato. Mm. No spicy. This is medium and spicy. Mm. This is habanero and tomato. Oh, okay. Okay, okay Gracias. thank you. They got the chicha around there. Mm -hmm. Crunchy, huh? Crunchy. Very porky. Mm -hmm. The sauce is pretty spicy. Mm -hmm. Very refreshing. It's my garita. Thank you. It's very light. It's uh, creamy. There's a big cubes of uh, cheese here. And then one teeny tiny dot of avocado, I believe. <laughs> That'll be nice to include a little more avocado. Yeah, it's avocado. It's just a little one drop. Yeah. <laughs> and then there's this cheese, and then the crunch from tortillas, chips. It's not bad. They try to make more like, a, kind of like more fancy. Mm. Pretty good. Fried right, dough stuffed with spiced pork. Spiced pork inside. Yeah, spiced pork rinds too. It's almost like jerky like. Mm. like. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Mm. It's okay. So there's beef and beans. Yeah, an oval tortilla prepared with blue corn dough, served with beans, roasted ribeye steak, canela cheese, and lettuce. Mm. Okay, let's give it a try. Smell beefy. It's actually pretty good. The beef is uh, it's actually pretty tender. And the fried dough underneath it is it's it's crispy from the outside and it's nice and moist from the inside. This is about this and mustard. Yeah. Wow. It's very light and it's actually sweet. It tastes almost like dessert. <laughs> and this is avocado. Yeah. Okay, so let's try this. Let's try this by itself. Lots of lime. Mmm, it's actually good. Mm. Mm. That's the best one so far. Yes, this is it's very refreshing. Good okay. yeah. Cactus salad and then yeah. some sprouts yeah. on top. Yeah. And then I see some kind of 
feta cheese, maybe? Yeah, mm, there's some kind of um, cheese, Mexican cheese, I think. Mm. Cactus salad with some onion, tomatoes, and uh, corn. Vegetarian, right? Yeah. It has a vegetarian taste to it. <laughs> it's actually pretty good. So what is that? If you use this one, it costs like a hundred dollars. Sauce, bean sauce, and red sauce, and tortilla fried, fried tortilla, coriander, cream, and cheese. The apasor is pineapple, coriander, onion, and green sauce. And the pineapple give a hint of freshness to it, but yet the uh, the seasoning of the uh, pork is really nice, full of spices and flavor. Really good. Chicken mole, with rice and chicken and mole. Okay. cooked for uh, many many hours. Yeah, it seems like it's, uh, it's a lot of work to make yeah, the sauce. Just... It's good. Yeah. It's like that traditional mole. Mm. The chicken is super tender. Mm. Very, very tender, the chicken. The mole is, uh, yeah, it tastes really good. It goes well with the rice as well. I know. A little bit of the rice here. You try with that. The chicken is really good. I like it. It's like very nice and soft, tender. Mm -hmm. It's a good dish. The chicken is really tender. Um, pea paper, okay? Mm -hmm. paper. Really mm -hmm. It's really good. It's very creamy, like the um, oh condensed milk in here. I can taste the condensed milk. With vanilla ice cream on top there. <laughs> the crepe is good. Give them up a bit. It's a very interesting. If you like nuts and want to be healthy, <laughs> this is your dessert. Yeah. 
my favorite. I like this crepe oh. because it's not as sweet. This one, I, this one is good too, but I think it's a little bit too sweet for me. Now let's visit Portofino, the Italian specialty restaurant. Anybody who likes cheese, they will find this heavenly good. Oh, I like how they burn the bottom. Oh, yeah. Mmm. Mmm. That's really good. Mmm. So cheesy. Yeah, the crust is not. It's 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 really nice and fresh, tasting crust. Definitely better than the uh, buffet pizza. Uh -huh. No comparison. Yeah. Mm. This one is triple thumbs up. <laughs> Of course, 
and then the risotto cooked like perfectly and it's not too um, like mushy or like too much water and has a perfect texture to it and then there's mushroom pieces and I think the spinach and tons of parmesan cheese mm. this I would think one of the best risotto I've ever tried Oh yeah, this is good. This is really good actually. Yum. Let's check out the food for the steakhouse, which is called El Dorado. This restaurant was especially popular, so be sure to book early if you're a meat lover. Just give you one, but today he says it's small, and there's three of us, so he gave us double, right? You order medium or medium, medium rare? rare? This looks more like medium yeah. to me. Let me try this sauce that I can't wait to try. It's mushroom sauce. It's really tender. Oh my god, I love that sauce. The sauce is really good. This, this part is kind of medium rare. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Okay. 
try seeing the middle here. We had it, we ordered medium rare, right? I normally like filet mignon better, but this one New York steak, I think it's better than mm. Seems more juicy, huh? It's a little bit more juicy, but I think what makes it even make it better than the filet mignon is that it has it's chewy, but I mean it's um, tender. It's juicy, but it has this really nice smoky flavor, mm. which is what the filignon is lacking, I think. Without the sauce, the filignon is not as, as as good. So let me try this with the sauce. This New York steak is so smoky and it's so good. I can eat it by itself without the sauce. Mm. But let's try with the sauce anyway. Because seriously, the sauce here, I can, um, I can smooth it on my face and all my body. Okay. <laughs> it's that good. It's really good. Mm. I think it's, it's go well with the sauce too. But the sauce goes better with the filet mignon. This steak here, this New York steak here, is perfectly fine to eat it by itself because the smokiness from it is so intense that it's so satisfying that you just eat by itself like that with your other, you know, side business here. That's a really good New York steak. And that's a wrap. Thanks for watching, everyone. Please comment, like, and subscribe if you haven't already. And we'll see you in another video.